There have been more films about Sherlock Holmes than almost any other character in the history of cinema, and there have been some really great ones. However, the series of films by Guy Ritchie that starred Iron Man himself, Robert Downey Jr. as the beloved private eye, became some of the biggest blockbusters ever made about the character. Despite the success of the first two films in the series, a third installment seems to be just as elusive as one of Holmes's cases. But why? Why are we still waiting for a movie that probably should have happened already, based on the amount of money that the previous two pulled in. After the second movie's revelation that Holmes is not, in fact, dead and actually alive and well, it seemed like Warner Brothers was just as keen to see Holmes and Watson get back together as Iron Man 3 screenwriter Drew Pierce was hired shortly after a Game of Shadows initial release to work on a draft for Sherlock Holmes 3. Unfortunately, Downey's obligations to his role as Tony Stark in the MCU meant that a third adventure for Holmes became a secondary priority for him. But over the years, we've heard from many people tied to the project that ideas were floating around and gears were turning. Warner Bros. even went so far as to set a 2020 release date for the movie at one point, which obviously didn't happen, in part due to COVID halting a lot of stuff, but that shows it was alive and well at one point. And as far as we know, it still is. So now all we can really do is just sit back and wait for now knowing full well that it is at least on the minds of many folks in Hollywood. Perhaps if you're watching this video in the future, it may have already been announced or even released. One can only hope.